नमस्कार आई एम डॉक्टर भारत पाटोदिया मेडिकल ऑन्कोलॉजिस्ट प्रैक्टिसिंग एट हैदराबाद इफ यू सर्च नेट ऑन करक्यूमेन एंड इट्स वेरियस मेडिसिनल इफेक्ट एक्चुअली यू विल फाइंड एन नंबर ऑफ पेपर्स विच इज सेंग दैट करक्यूमेन इज नॉट इफेक्टिव बट इफ यू गो इन डिटेल अबाउट दिस आर्टिकल्स यू विल फाइंड दैट the type of curcumin they have used is actual not bio available so they have used plain curcumin extract a con- curcumin concentrates few of the pe- few of these papers might have used a uh, novel delivery mechanism of curcumin how i understand this because of the poor bio availability means whatever amount of bio uh, whatever amount of curcumin you take orally a fraction of it get absorbed if it is low bio available the novel drug delivery systems like nanoparticleization or liposomal formulation of curcumin and different compound can increase the bio availability of a drug novel studies should be done new set of studies will be coming which studies curcumin with these drug delivery system as a practical medical oncologist a patient's safety is on the top priority for me in this regard i actually did a extensive review of literature what about the curcumin and various chemotherapy drug interaction and to my satisfaction i found that there is absolutely no interaction between curcumin and chemotherapy side effects rather there are n number of studies which shows which have utilized very high amount of curcumin up to 12 grams with different different chemotherapy drugs in my practice i find around 2 tablets of nanosomal curcumin per day very well tolerable with most chemotherapy protocols as with any tablet it is often asked to me should i take nano curcumin with food after food before food empty stomach so thankfully these are water soluble and does not have interaction with uh, food items so it's a personal opinion you prefer it empty stomach or with food or after food i personally recommend it to take either with food or after food simply because it makes it more palatable and you don't miss it you don't forget it